hello everyone and welcome to another tutorial today i will show you how to fix a zip to a trouser if you watched my previous video on how to cut trouser pocket i believe you see this so i have the two the zip cover which is called the flap mostly so this first one it's plain but the second one i had a fusing on it can you see i had a fusing to this but this one is plain this is the right hand of the trouser and this is the left. So the first thing you are going to do now is, you see this is the trouser, I already fixed the pocket. And so all you have to do is just to place the boot on each other like this, place it over each other like this and measure seven inch from here. Can you see that you measure seven inch down to this place? Then you make it small notch here. Then just make it notch here. Can you see that? Can you see that? Measure seven inch from here down to this place. Then you make a notch. So all you're going to do first now is simple. After you make your notch, from your notch right here, you're going to stitch it down. Can you see that? You're going to stitch it from here from here to this place make sure you leave a little bit of space around here so you are going to stitch it twice you are going to stitch it twice so you are going to do another one Do you see that? So what we are going to do now is open this up. You see what we have here? Make sure this one is facing the trouser like this. Can you see what I did? Now, all you are going to do now, take this and fold it together like this. Fold it like this. This is your zip. Face it on the trouser. Make sure the zip is facing the trouser. Do you see that? Make sure the front of the zip, this part, this front part of the zip is facing the trouser like this. Then you place this over it, just like this. Can you see that? You place this at the back of your trouser. Make sure the zip is facing the trouser just like this. You can, you can open this up. To make it easier so just like this open the zip up place it over the trouser like this we are going to stitch it Make sure you don't stitch beyond the notch. Do you see that? This is what we have now. So if you zip this up, this is what we have so far. Can you see that? So now all you're going to do with this is simple. Place this also. Make sure you are facing the left side of the trouser. You see that? So just sew it also.
Make sure you don't go beyond the notch. Make sure you don't go beyond the notch right there. Do you see that? So now, when you turn your trouser like this, you make sure this goes inside. And so far, we have this. Can you see that? Are you seeing what I'm doing? So far, we have this. So now, all you have to do is turn your trouser over like this. Can you see the inside? Can you see the inside like this? So when you open this, look at this. I add a little bit of frizzing around here. Can you see that? In order to give the clothes a shape, a hard stiff around here. Just add a little bit of stiff around here, somewhere like this. Don't forget to stiff this also. So when you open your when you open this up like this. All you have to do is just to take this. Can you see this? Take it like this to the trouser. Take it like this. Take it like this, then open this up into two. Can you see that? You open that part up, open the zip, and place it like this. On the, on the flap. Can you see that? Can you see that? So what you're going to do now is... You see what I'm doing? Make sure this go inside a little bit, somewhere around here, and make sure this come around here. So you're going to stitch this up. I hope you saw what I did just now. I stitch this to the flap. Can you see that? So when you zip this up, we're going to have our zipper right there. Right there. Do you see that? Do you see that? So now what we're going to do is just to make our crotch. It's a little bit of problem here. That can be solved easily with an iron. That's easy. Use a trouser like this. You can open it up. To get the easy crush, it's mostly around 1.5 inch. Can you see that? If you can't get a straight crush around here, you can easily use a ruler, measure it, rule it down, and cough it to this place. But let me just sew this straight. Let me see this straight. Down here, all you have to do is open up this part so that it won't affect your. So I'm going to solve this problem. This part, all you just have to do is just to turn that part in. Very big. Let's make a notch. I hope you saw what I just did just now. Do you see that? 
Can you see that? It's a little bit difficult to see the thread because it's so in. I use a very a deep stitch, so this is it. So all you have to do now is just to simple. Open this part a little bit up and stitch. And stitch the inner part of this. Just make a stitch on it. In order to stitch the under part. Child. As simple as that. Pull this out. So so far. We have our trouser. For this, all you just have to do is just to iron this down. It's going to stay well. So we have our zip, our trouser zip. Can you see that? So all you have to do is just simple. We're gonna have to sew this part. You're going to measure your waist here. Which is 30, 35, which should be 7 and a half, 17 and a half, sorry. Let's, let's sew this down straight. So, so far we have our trouser here, right here. Let me turn this over. So, so far this is our trouser. I've ironed this. Can you see? Easily. The trouser is done. So, that is how to make, how to fix a zip to a trouser. If you're new to my channel, make sure you click the subscriber button because I'm going to show you how to make the band and the best strap and how to complete the sewing of a trouser. Make sure you click the subscriber button and click the notification bell to stay connected to my recent and new video. And I'm gonna see you very, very soon. Thank you.